Hello everybody, and today, I'm just playing some more Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare 2, because, you know what? I figured, why not? It's a great game, it's fun to play, and I should probably hone in my skills on this. Getting crits with this is a pain, to be sure. Well, I guess you don't even need crits with General Supremo. Unlike where Agent P, where his entire gimmick is that if you get a crit, um, it does a lot of damage. Normally I'm not that wasteful, but drastic times call for drastic measures. No. We're noping right on out of there. Nine percent. That's a bro moment and a half right there. Well, that works. What if we didn't, though? How did all oh, the splash damage fall off on that is so... It's so painfully stupid. The fall, it falls off, where it's like, if you d land a direct shot, it deals 250 damage. And if you miss it by, like, three inches, it only does 50. What kind of damage fall off is that? It, it doesn't matter that they're winning, because we can just pull a... Victory literally out of thin air like this Yeah, you can just pull a victory out of thin air just like that Yeah, ZPG like the damage fall off is like really questionable There we go. Alright, there we go. They, they say that they're winning, but they're only winning by one. Uh, a victory by one isn't really much. Oh, nice. Got a thing for that. Again, damage fall off. Nope, not gonna mess with that. Yeah, we're th literally four away from victory. Scientists! Scientists! Thank you, scientists! Woo! That was a real close one. Thank you, science man. That was actually scarily close. That was a lot of coins. Scientists are definitely underrated. I'm feeling crazy. Let's uh, change up the map while I'm not looking. Okay. I I actually have my eyes closed during that, so that um you know it's a bit more random. Do I want to go Ice P or Agent? 
you know what, Let, let's show off the um, Ice P because I think I already did one for the Agent P. Old fashioned hamburgers, alrighty. Alrighty, Crazy Dave, whatever you say. There we go. Whoa! That's a lot of damage! Can't believe that actually worked. That sombrero beam bomb. Get those crits. Gotta get those crits. Get back here. Or to fight me, you have to fight me head on. Fine then. Ownage. Die. While I run away. Yeah, boy. Oh, that was close. Sure, the imp got me, but here's the thing. I, it, I've been responsible for, like, I think six deaths? Yes, yeah, six, I got six kills, I think. Due to that one chili beam bomb. So, so far, we're actually doing good. Whoa! Three kills! Woo! Woo! Who knew a triple kill was that powerful? Alright, let's go. Hold up. Yeah, an imp's right there. Okay, so it appears as though... Yeah, there's a big group right around here. So, yeah, so if I space it correctly, that'll get a lot of kills. Okay, only one kill. Th that's fine, that's fine. I'm still in a net positive amount of kills. Now, this is a much bigger lead than we initially had, than the plants had on the other. Yo, let's just, let's just, come on, chili beam, get him! Okay, but, like, here's the thing about it. The sombrero beam bomb. Excellent. Oh, yes, I think I spaced it right. Well, I just got two more kills. Even if the round didn't end there, I still would have gotten about two to three more kills due to the perfectly spaced chili beam bomb. Let's go. So yeah, that's a pretty good video. Let's call it there.